What is up everybody and welcome to game number 140 of the rank climb for today's game. I'm going to be playing my second promo game in gold 2 and uh, to get into gold 1 obviously. So all I have to do is win this game and I'll be in gold 1. If I lose I'll have to play another game and I'll have to play that game right after this one. Uh, so anyhow, um, I was going to say something. Oh yeah, so the reason for this video being as delayed as it is, usually it's like what? Like it comes out 10 hours earlier is because I had to deal with some personal stuff in real life so I had business to attend to so sadly I could you know like record and upload as usual but you know hey I'm still here now so I'm gonna be able to uh, pull this off for you guys and uh, yeah I took my time because I really wanted to make sure that you know my first games of the day were gonna be played and it's not gonna be like a recording I've been trying to do more like games before I record to make sure that I'm not so rusty so that I actually perform on time. And uh, yeah, uh, sadly I didn't get to practice any Tristana today, but I have been playing quite a bit of Tristana in the past uh, few days. So I think that this game is going to be okay. Honestly, uh, Tristana is actually like one of the power picks at the moment in solo queue when it comes to AD carrying. And I've seen some people do some insane shit on this champion, and I'm like, whoa, I want to do that too. So, like, I've been picking her up and trying to play her. And not to mention, someone actually wanted to see it in my channel. I think it was one of the comments said, like, oh, please play Tristana. I was like, oh, okay, sure, I'll play her sometime. So that's why I kept practicing her, and then I realized, you know, Tristana's actually, like, a legitimate pick at the moment. So it wasn't such a bad thing to try and play her more. But uh, the thing is... I don't actually think I'm that efficient with Tristana yet. I, I understand she's a very simple champion, but sometimes with even the simplest things, like there are some small details that you may want to add to uh, whenever you play. Uh, are they invading or are they like turning around? What is this? They're gonna hi they're gonna hide in this brush. What the hell? Uh, all I needs to do is put a water. Oh wait, they have. Okay, they don't have Blizzcrank. I thought it was trash. I mean, I I thought they had a Blizzcrank, but it's actually a trash. Oh, here we go. Oh, sh Oh my god. Okay, that is probably not worth it. No, definitely not worth it. This is a disaster. Wow, that bomb, though. That 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 did so much damage to Aatrox. Look at his health. Damn, though. Uh, yeah, it's a shame we just gave, like, first blood pretty much for free there. I don't know why you would do that when you're not, like, an entire team. Like... If Fizz was there, maybe that would have been a good face check because of how low Aatrox got, but yeah, there was no way it was going to be like a, a good thing at any point, but whatever. Uh, let's just go ahead and help out Divi with the with the Gromp. Who was the one that got the first blood? Um, oh, it was... God damn it. Holy shit, why does this always happen to me? I hate this game, dude. Oh my god. Oh wait, that's a support nade carry. Alright. Anyhow, um, so the Draven getting first blood is actually a really big deal because not only is it that like a hundred, a hundred extra gold that he normally wouldn't have gotten from any other kill, but he also gets fifty gold extra from his passive, so that's basically four hundred fifty gold. God damn! And what? He started longsword pots, dude. I haven't seen that start since like the beginning of season three, I think. Wow, that's really old school. Anyways. Oh. Oh, uh, he actually hit that on me. Oh, we're going. Wow, I eat a minion. I hate this game already. I hate this game already. Wow, he actually exhausted that? I don't think he needed to. I feel like I was getting safe there. Anyways, um, yeah, this game is already off to a really bad start. Not because of the whole, like, first blood incident, but also because of, like, what used to happen there. Uh, so being an exhaust down versus a lane that just got first blood is never a good thing. But whatever. It is an all the support, and I should be more careful about my positioning in lane, actually. Because getting hooked like that really made it easy for, you know, Draven to do his thing. Either way. Um, looks like any got all in by Cassiopeia. That sucks. And our jungler dies too. What was that? Golems? Grumps? Or Krugs? There we go. Um, yeah. This is gonna be a slow game, I can already tell. But that's fine, because uh, uh, Tristana actually happens to be more of the uh, late game AD carry than she is like a laning AD carry. I mean, the, the changes that were made to her made her into a, actually a much better laner than she once used to be. But, yeah, I don't know. 
I guess she's not as late game as she used to be, but she's more like middle, middle laning phase than she once was. Yeah, that's probably the best way to explain that. Anyway, so yeah, I'm just gonna try and farm it out. The only problem is that if you make it a, a Draven lane into a farm lane, is that if Draven happens to get a kill while he's like really farmed up, he's gonna get so much gold. So yeah, I don't know. Playing maybe like completely passive is not like the best idea, and I haven't really been like throwing my bombs out on Draven because I'm I'm a little bit scared that I'm gonna get hooked because I'm gonna like put myself out of position to just do this. Oh look. Uh yeah, I was about to walk into like trash play there, so. Better to back off a little bit. Maybe I should do my bomb on Trash too. Mm. Okay, so Cassie P is having the run of her life in, in middle right now. That's not so good for us, it's very good for them. Let's go ahead and get this minion. Oh! That actually hit! Oh my god, that was the mother of all bullshit hooks. Oh my god, I can't believe that hit. That was like literally at the limit of the Q hitbox. Let's see. Let's get this minion. Let's get this one. Let's get that one. And let's get this one. And oh, oh my god, what are you kidding me? Okay, okay, the youngest here. Oh, that was so bullshit. Stand aside when like I pretty much I just jumped out. Oh my god, I thought I was gonna hit, but the minions luckily enough blocked it. Wow, Wukong actually gets rid of my Tranky Ward with his damn like uh Rafing. Okay, so we see that Wukong is leaving the lane there. Alright, that was good. He's like, kinda go back to farming, but Wukong might come from the tri brush. He's like doing like a, a looping gank. But, uh, I don't think. Wait, Nolus, is that. Yeah, your trinket. Oh, no, wait, it doesn't show trinket cooldown. Never mind. Um. Or does it? I'm not sure. Uh. Whatever. <laughs> uh, okay, so, anyways, awkward laning face. What? How do we send down the last hit? Wow. Tristana, stop. Okay. Get this minion. Last hit the siege, not the small one. Come on, Nautilus. Come on, get it. There we go. Alright, let's get this minion. Uh, get this one. No! What? Are you kidding me? Okay. I was a little bit scared. I thought maybe Trish was gonna like try and play hook, but he didn't. Uh, Nautilus is abandoning me. He went to ward. Alright. Okay, let's accept that. Mm, how's the farm? 44 to 50. Okay. What the hell? Oh my god. This is gonna be a rough game. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I'm gonna change aggro to Draven. Get some odd tags off on him. <laughs> Trash pulling him into. T Trash pulling Draven into himself actually causes him to take damage from my bomb that wasn't trash. That's awesome. Alright. So anyways, Draven is like super low right now, so I should probably just go ham here. Nice. Alright, that forces him out of the farming a little bit. He's probably just gonna go back to base now, because that probably put him like super low. Yeah, there he is. Alright, so he went back to base. Nice! I forced back first blood Draven. Uh, I think the biggest problem that Draven had was that he didn't go back immediately after getting the first blood to like make use of that like obvious early advantage in gold. He had advantage in experience though because of the kill, but you know, it's not really that big of a deal. Having an ha having a, a Doran's Blade extra would have been a very big deal. Like he doesn't even have a first one, so like just having one would have been amazing. Anyways, Bottling is completely pushed in. Um, I'm gonna go back now and just get my BS sword. Holy shit! I didn't realize I had farmed that much. Usually I don't manage to do these backs anymore. Okay, let's get the BS sword, let's get boots, let's get pots, and let's just go back to lane. Alright, so what did Draven get? Oh my god, he got a BS sword and freaking Vamp Scepter? That sucks. <laughs> I mean, it's it's good, but it sucks for me because I have to deal with that now. But that's kind of where my Dorn's Blade comes into play, you know? What is better early, a Dorn's Blade or Vamp Scepter? I would probably say Vamp Scepter because you do get, um... The health, but it's only 70 health, so it's not really that much. But still, it means that if you come down, to, if it comes down to a burst fight, uh, the Doran's Blade user will probably survive. And uh, incidentally enough, Draven is kind of like a burster. Mm. Oh, oh my God, I got that minion! I really thought I was gonna miss that one. Okay, anyhow, um, 
So with the base sword, my E is gonna do a lot of damage. So it's gonna be really good. Oh, okay. It looks like Nautilus is going on a James Bond mission together with Vice. So I guess I'm just gonna lane slowly. Oh shit! Damn, I missed that minion. Uh oh, Fizz is threatening to go AFK. <laughs> um. Okay, so Draven is around middle now. Okay, I'm gonna start pushing them. No, I missed the minion, please. Uh, what? 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 All right. Well, he took some damage for that. Half damage. Oh, I see now why he did that. Wukong is level six. All right, that almost sucked. But um. Hmm. Okay, so Trash basically wanted to bait me in, giving me a false sense of security. And uh, I did also feel like that was really strange, but hey. At least he's not killing us right now. Uh, let's just get some harass off. I have this feeling that Wukong is not around Bali anymore. What's with these pings? Uh, I think Fist is like really tilted, but mm, what can you do? Uh, oh, look at that. Trash is... What is he doing? Is he standing in tri rush Dude, what, what is Trash doing? What? I don't... What is he... Is he warding... Oh, he warded Dragon? Okay. I see. Oh, okay. Uh... Uh... I really wanted to do more... Whoa! That was with just one auto attack, and Draven took a lot of damage from my E. Holy shit, this champion... Oh, god. Oh my god. This stupid monkey. Anyways, there seems to be an, a problem going on with the team right now. I'm really not trying to pay attention to it and just try to play with my lane. But uh, it seems like everyone is getting affected, so it's a little bit sad. Anyways, because we have pure vision of Wukong, we can actually lane. So I don't know why we're not doing it. Oh, that sidestep of justice. Oh, oh my god. Wait, where was the, where was the, ex where was the exhaust? Wait, no, you didn't have one? You didn't have exhaust for the Draven? Oh, uh, that should be kill, I think. No way! He didn't, he didn't die? Alright, whatever. I really thought I didn't need to turn around to deal the damage there, but it seems I needed to. Wow, this, what was that fist? Holy, alright, this fist is super tilted. Anyways, that sucked. I swear I could have gotten a kill if I actually auto attack one more time on Trash. But, um... Uh, I thought, you know, if I turn around to auto attack, I would stop myself to take enough damage for uh, Draven to just get a kill on me. So I felt like it wasn't right to just go ham. So, yeah, I'd rather Trash not have a kill. And, uh, uh oh. I'm getting some random messages in my, <laughs> in my chat. Sorry, only solo queue ranked. Anyways, uh, what was I saying? I was saying... What was I saying? What was I saying? I was talking about... Oh yeah, the trash. Uh, basically, i rather me and Draven not have a, a kill. Because, you know, Draven's passive really, like, uh... It really snowballs, so, like... Oh, shit! Okay, here we go, ham! Here we go, ham! Oh, oh, please, please, one on deck! Yes, this is kill! Oh, yeah, I did it! Oh, wait! Oh, no, 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 I'm so stupid! I thought he was still tanking it! Holy shit, that was so dumb by me! Damn, I'm brainless. I thought we were going ham for the Draven too, and now Draven gets the kill. Okay, my bad. That was actually pretty bad. All right, let's go back. Sorry, I, I, I meant what I said. All right, let's get pickaxe and let's get Sir Greaves. The attack speed really helps with getting more damage off with the E spell. Um, wow, there's actually a lot of things going on in the game right now, and it seems to be quite a chaos. Jesus. Alright, anyway, so I did get myself a kill, but Draven ended up getting a kill because I did a big mistake. Wow, I, I really, like, get got into, like, a blind rage almost. Like, I was like, oh my god, we can kill Draven too? I mean, oh wait. We can kill this guy here. No way! Oh, oh no! I was gonna W there, but I didn't in time. Jesus Christ! Why does freaking Tristana W have like a casting time? That's so dumb. Whatever. Party and bot.
Yeah, I guess it is, but still. That was a 2v2 loss, basically. Mm. It's a shame that um, Trash didn't die fast enough. Mm, what should I build now? I guess I should just build like for the po the parts for Feminizer. Nice, Fist gets top lane killed, or the top tower. And let's go towards bot lane, although I feel like Annie's probably gonna take some of my minions, or most of them. Because in solo queue, people usually don't respect lanes, and they just farm wherever. Uh, wow, Aatrox is actually having a pretty good time, it seems. Sucks for us. But Aatrox is actually not... Oh my god, really? They made Fizz rage quit? Man. This sucks. Mm, whatever. Uh, I'll, I'll take responsibility for this game. This game could have been a little bit different if the Draven didn't get that kill on all this, which I feel like was my fault. Because the only reason Nautilus went in was because I pretty much fucked up, and that's why he died. So his death is technically my death. Okay, fist reconnected. Nice. Mm, I guess I'm just gonna push mid now. Oh, this freaking fat ass Kazipia. Man. Alright, I'm just gonna try and get some minions here. I really need to get my uh, Infinity Edge ASAP. I just now got level 9, so I have like my maxed out E. But why, why aren't people going bot lane? Okay, what was that? Oh! Oh! Oh, wait. I'm gonna put a ward here. I'll attack him some more. And ult him to finish him off. And are we still gonna do this? I feel like this is a mistake. Alright, I healed maybe a little bit wasted here. Uh, the ultimate is gonna return, but uh... Oh shit! No, 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 no! This is so bad! Oh my god, I don't know what I was thinking, but I thought maybe, like... Maybe me and Arliss could have bursted out the Draven fast enough for him to just die before I die, but... Obviously, I, I can't make the math on the damage here, and I'm actually dealing a lot less damage than I think I can. Oh, nice. Vi's gonna get a kill thanks to Red Buff. Alright. Uh, let's get this, and... Oh, I can't finish this off. This sucks. Let's swap this to a blue trinket. Yeah. Anyways, uh... Yeah, th that sucked. It really sucked. I mean, Draven had a blood thirster, so he was actually, you know, sustaining really hard in that fight. So, uh, he kinda outlasted me there, and even though me and Draven... And me and the Nautilus were on him, it was like, yeah. It, it it really wasn't gonna happen because he was just life stealing for way too much. Whereas I wasn't like life stealing anything. Sucked. Uh, let's get this and let's get this and let's get this and that. And just auto attack it once. Get alone. Oh my god! And then oh my god, Trist E passive is so annoying when it last hits. Oh shit. Uh, people are probably gonna be pushing mid lane now, so I'm, I'm gonna walk around the safe way. I don't really wanna stay bot lane on my own, so I'm not gonna keep pushing it. Alright, oh wait, they split up. Okay, I'm gonna be in bot lane on my own then. Good, cause I see Wukong is top lane. Only 13 10 guys, easy win. Yeah, this game is not lost. Lost yet. <laughs> Why are people saying this? It's like. Oh shit, what just. Okay, that should be Draven dead at least, and it should give me enough time to actually, uh. Push down the bot turret, because if there's something that the Neutrosan is really good at, it's to actually destroy towers. Like the E spell on towers is actually pretty ridiculous. Nice, holy shit, snowball. My team doesn't even need me. Whatever. And let's just go ahead and get the tower. It's kind of funny how my team is able to come back like that, but I feel like it's mainly due to the fact that Draven probably feels invincible at the moment. Like, he even bought that uh, Snowball item, <laughs> Sword of the Occult, which kind of shows that he's going a little bit insane. But, alright, you know, if he wants to do that, fine. Um, Draven might be around bot. Uh-oh, not Draven, but uh, the Aatrox. Uh, one is Dragon, one minute. Drake, one minute. Okay. So let's just go to this brush and recall to get my infinity edge. And can I also afford seagull? Yeah, I think so. Or I'm really bad at math right now. We'll see, we'll see. Infinity edge and seal. Yes, I can. Nice. Okay, so now I'm going to be dealing a decent amount of damage. Mm, I will never get used to the fact that uh, Tristana's attack range is 
longer than the average AD carry because now like the current persona feels so aggressive you like you're supposed to jump on people destroy them with your explosive shots and stuff or explosive charge sorry uh, where's this yeah oh oh steal that no oh 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 okay I'm gonna ult him before like he kills me with his W or Q rather oh 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 I should have gone for the Cassiopeia I'm so stupid Damn, for some reason I thought maybe we could get Aatrox before like he gets pulled out by the trash, but it seems like that wasn't the case. Wait, what the hell? Nolus actually went in while we decided to go for Dragon? Uh, this feels like a big disconnect between players. Flash, flash, auto attack. Yes! No! Freaking trash! What a dick bag. I mean, we got Dragon, but that was a really bad team fight. We should have settled for Dragon or the team fight, and instead we like split up into like two divisions where like Vi actually went for Dragon mostly. All right, Fist, you can do this, I believe. Oh, ah. oh, he's not tanky enough. He's not strong enough to pull that off. Oh wow, I don't think this was a good Q, but he might actually still get out. Um, anyways, we are settling for the Phantom Dancer. Anyways, that trash is actually getting the kill, so it's not really that bad. No, we're not surrendering this game. This game is far from over. Actually felt good to kill that Draven there, but it was a shame that, you know, Trash was kind of there to help him out. I feel like that was a really bad team fight, though. I feel like Nolus did a big mistake by trying to go in while everyone was doing dragons. So, like, Nolus was soaking a lot of damage while nobody was, you know, dealing damage to the ones that were dealing damage. So, it was... Basically a very inefficient tanking that Nolus did there. He started a fight and nobody was ready to back him up with. So, um, as much as I feel sorry for this Nolus for giving him that one kill in Bali, or that one death, sorry, uh, that was that was pretty much all Nautilus. The fact that we had like a bad team fight even though we won Dragon. And it wasn't even like that completely bad, but like it became an ace, so it's not really that cool. Hey, oh wait, it, it seems like Nautilus realizes this himself, he was like, well, super YOLO, sorry. Yeah, it was. And like, it's not like we're winning that hard yet, so you can't really get away with plays like that. Alright, anyways, Vi seems to be very uh, adamant about getting Trinity Force and then we're gonna win. I'm not so sure about that. Vi is good with Trinity Force, but she doesn't scale like that insanely well with it. Like, she doesn't suddenly become like the god carry. So I'm not really putting much faith into this Vi's word. This is personally because I play Vi myself and I know what it's like. Oh no! No, where's the ultimate? Nullus! Ult! 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 There we go! Oh shit. Alright. Anyways. This Wait, did I use? Yeah, I fucking did it again. Oh my god, I hate this game. Uh oh. Uh oh. Auto attack this freaking Aatrox away from me. Come on. Wait, that's the real one, that's the real one! And he's dead, alright. So, uh, yeah. Ulting away the Aatrox there was so good because I actually accidentally, um... Uh... <laughs> oh man, that was bad. That was a bad W. I I'm still a very bad Tristana, so I'll, I'll owe up to that. I feel like I don't really understand when I should be going in and when I should, like, you know, kind of stay in the back and auto attack. Because I'm someone who likes going ham in general. Although sometimes I do have a good head on my shoulders. Just when I play your son, it doesn't seem to be the case. I, I like, yeah, I go in at really bad times. You already saw uh, an example of that in, in bottling when like I got Nautilus killed. Is the blue buff up? Oh, it isn't. I was gonna steal that shit, but you know, shit happens. Uh, I don't have a ward on me, so I can't place one here. I would have otherwise. Damn. So, I'm gonna ping Baron that, you know, ward Baron, because the enemy team might rush it, like, after, like, pushing middle like that and not getting the inhib. Uh, it kinda makes me feel uneasy that nobody still warded Baron, but, mm, whatever. Alright, let's get an upgrade, and let's get, oh, wait, 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 pink ward will be pretty good against Wukong. There we go. Oh, okay, guess if he has bot lane. Uh, I don't think Baron is at risk then. Um, hey, let's catch this guy again. Come on, come on. Nautilus, are you ready? Your ultimate is up. Every time Nautilus' ultimate is up, it's a free kill on Draven, pretty much. Come on. No, Nautilus, no! Why are you going for the trash? Holy shit! No! Freaking Draven flashed. So sad. What? Is Nautilus seriously still chasing? Damn. We're gonna walk into the Wukong death here. Um, okay. Oh, shit. No! 
damn. Oh wow, hang on. Oh, okay, okay. Give me vision, damn it! I can't. I can't. Uh, oh my god, I ought to attack him away from us at least. Got a W out of here because that was really bad. What? Oh, that was so odd. Um. Okay, that's him stunned. I'm gonna back out. Trash is still there with low health. Nice. Vi actually gets the Aatrox killed. That's good. Oh, uh, if only. Oh, wait. We got vision of that Wukong. Oh, nice. Good Falcon Punch. Nice. Kazipi dies after, too. Good job, team. Mm -hmm. You know, even if you fuck up with Tristana, she's still like the safest AD carry in the game. So, like, she makes she just makes all the sense in solo queue. Like, someone is on you and your team isn't peeling for you, you ult them away. If if ulting them away wasn't good enough, you just jump away. So like you have like so many solutions to problems that normally other AD carries would like really struggle with. Because most AD carries they do have a jump, but they don't have like a a thing that like pushes someone away really far from you. And uh, that's really good for Tristana because when you push someone away with your ultimate, you can probably still auto attack them because of your ridiculous auto attack range that increases for every level. Um, it's actually really easy to forget that because, I don't know, sometimes I look at Tristana players and they seem to auto attack from the same range that they would have like around level 1. And the thing is, you can actually, you know, really abuse that auto attack range. It's like, is this still the longest auto attack range outside of Kog'Ma W and Twitch Ultimate? I think it is. Yeah. So like, you gotta, you gotta abuse such advantages that you have over other champions. Oh nice, that's a free kill on the... On the trash. I'm not so sure that Vi really needs my help here. I thought maybe I could help my team in case like Wukong goes in, but it seems like it's just gonna be a free dragon. Alright, so that's the second dragon. Wait, we're really gonna do Baron right after? Alright. Um, I kind of feel like this is YOLO, but um, it is YOLO because on the only dead person is trash, and they could potentially kill us at Baron with like a Wukong ultimate. But we do have full vision of Wukong at the moment, he's just uh, trying to de-push the waves out. So, you know, it's not such a bad deal. And, uh, yeah, it seems like it's pretty much gonna be a free Baron at this point. Like, there's no way the enemy team can, like, come in time and just stop us from this. I feel like Andy should've helped, but whatever, we'll still manage to do it. Oh, we're gonna get that guy? Does Nullus have... Oh, he doesn't have Righteous Glory. Sad. I'm gonna... Oh no! No no no! What? What? Oh my god! My team went for... Oh my god, dude! I could have been so dead! Uh... Oh oh yeah, I'm not I'm not falling for this bait. I'm, I'm like falling for like the Nullus Blind Rage. Okay. Mm, okay. Anyway, so my plan there was to like jump on the Draven and auto attack him several times so I can like get him slowed down with my red buff. And then, you know, my team would easily pick up the Draven, but apparently my team went the other way and picked up the Aatrox, which is, you know, good. But the thing is, I thought my team was gonna follow up on my play, and I almost ended up dying to, like, Trash Hook. Or would have died to Trash Hook in normal circumstances. But, hey, it worked out, and Draven didn't get a kill at all. Alright, so, is this... Trash has a Frozen Heart. Wulkan has Ninja Tabbies. Mm, Aatrox has... Only a frozen mouth, that's no armor, that's just health. Okay, so Bloodthirster's third item is totally doable in this case. You know, I don't really need to get the Lost Whisper because the only tanky person is the Thresh. And with exception Wukong, but you know, I can deal with that. I can deal with that just fine. Um, my main objectives to kill should at least be uh, Draven and Cassiopeia pretty much, so like it, it shouldn't really matter that much that I'm, uh, I'm not going for early Lost Whisper. Oh no! Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Oh, what? Wukong didn't go back in? I really thought, like... Um... Uh, okay, maybe I shouldn't show myself there. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, what? Okay, 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 okay. Draven just jumping on me on his own is, like, really dangerous. Okay, let's just go back here. Oh! No, wait! That was not the real one! Okay, let's switch to targets here. Oh, there we go. Maybe should have ulted there because he was actually really close to killing the fist because the ult actually, you know, deals burst damage. And he would have definitely killed like Draven instantly, but I knew that I could save my ultimate and use kill him with auto attacks. Anyways, yeah, looks like the game is a win, and I'm gonna get into 
gold one for <laughs> for like some really strange ass beginning of the game. Anyways, um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, hope you liked this video. And if you did like it, it would be nice to give it a like. If this is the first time watching my videos, you can always subscribe to me. I'm always trying to upload new ranked games daily. Other than that, thank you guys for watching, and uh, hopefully I'll see you guys for tomorrow's games or game. Sorry. It's, there's not gonna be two episodes tomorrow. <laughs> that was only a one-time thing. Well, it might happen again, but you know, it's not gonna happen like every day. All right. Okay. This has been me, Steve Rockers, and hopefully, I'll see you guys tomorrow.